Hi, my name is Mike Johnson. I'm taking you on an inside and outside video tour and explanation about this 2014 Toyota Prius plug-in hybrid. This car's low mileage. It's only got 47,000 original miles. It's a pearl white color and it comes with a lot of benefits. This car is your friend and it has a lot of benefits. Some of these benefits include you can, depending if you're pre-qualified or post-qualified, you can get up to $10,500 in cash incentives to buy this car, which is more than half the cost of buying the car, uh, for sure, in, uh, under any circumstance. So $10,500 in cash government incentives are available, and I'm gonna explain those in the video. It has another government benefit, is this car qu uniquely qualifies for the carpool sticker, the pur light purple carpool sticker that lets any driver drive it all alone in the carpool lane. And that's a really big deal too. So you have a government benefit for carpool lane access and a government benefit for cash to help you buy the car. So, this, so what's special about this car is that this is a plug-in hybrid. It's just like a regular Prius. It looks like a regular Prius, except it has a slightly bigger battery. And when you bought it new, it was a lot more expensive. You could buy the regular Prius for about $24,000. And if you got some good deal at the dealer, out the door, but not this one. This one was closer to $36,000 brand new at the dealership to go buy it brand new. So it's a more expensive than the regular Prius. And that's because it's a dual fuel vehicle. It runs on electric fuel or gasoline fuel or any combination of the both of the two. You never have to plug this car in. You want to, but you don't have to. You do have to put gasoline and keep gasoline in it at all times. Now, specifically about this car, let's talk about this specific car. It's very clean, pearl white. There's not any uh, big scratch or or dent to point out it's real clean tires are almost brand new I didn't put the tires on I bought it with these really good tires on it bumpers in good condition wheels are in good condition it drives good uh, it's a, a nice clean car and now also about the specific car I mentioned we can get the light purple HOV stickers now that's a really big deal because most of the Prius plugins that you're going to find, and this is in California right now, most, almost all of the cars that you'll see advertised for sale cannot get the light purple HOV stickers. They cannot use the carpool lane anymore because over 235,000 cars, including Prius plugins, Chevy Volts, Ford Fusion Energies, Ford C Max Energies, Teslas, all sorts of electric cars all sorts of natural gas powered cars got kicked out of the carpool lane because they changed the rules on the stickers a car is only allowed to have the stickers for three full years from now on and whatever's left of the fourth year so it's 2019 if you apply for stickers this year you can have the stickers for the rest of this year and three more years which means your light purple if you get the stickers this year will expire in 2023 if you wait till next year, you can get the stickers until 2024. It'll be a different color. They change the color of the stickers each year. So all the cars that are already in California and already had the green carpal stickers down on the bumper, the cars that already had those cannot have the stickers anymore because they've exceeded the three years that they're allowed to have them. Okay, that's why this car is special because this car is not from California. This car is from another state, it was never registered in California, does not have license plates, it's not on the DMV system yet. Never had carpool stickers before, so you'll have the chance to be the first owner in California and you'll get brand new clean carpool stickers from DMV. Light purples, good for three, almost four years. That's how that works. And you can verify in writing 
that it can get the stickers that it never had the green stickers before. I can show you how to do that. I'll show you in a few minutes. Before we keep blabbering on about all the benefits, let's look at some of the features that this car has. This car has heated seats, cloth seats, but they're heated seats. The Toyota Prius plugins get heated seats. This car has a dash cover, a really nice clean one, a brand new dash cover. The original dash mat. It's very nice fluffy dash. It has navigation system. It has backup camera when you put it in reverse. It's got backup camera. It's got Bluetooth. So Bluetooth connectivity for your phone. So when you get in and you start driving, you can have hands-free playback. So when a call comes in, you just press here to answer the call or here to hang up. And then your music streams wirelessly to the radio. Works really good. Has voice activated navigation. So you just press this button on the steering wheel and you say, for example, destination California. And then it'll ask for the house number, street, and city. And then you tell it that. It'll navigate you there. You don't even have to punch it in. But you can punch it in. And once you've set a destination in here, it has your previous destinations. So if you know where home is and where work is and the common places that you go, they're all saved in the navigation. It's a full feature radio with apps. It has Entune apps like iHeartRadio, Bing, fuel prices, live traffic information. So if you connect your phone by USB cable to the USB port in the car, it'll use your cellular data, a very minimal, minimal amount, and connect to the internet and get the live traffic data so there's no extra subscription fees. That doesn't cost you anything other than the data you're already paying for from your cell phone provider. Has dual glove boxes and we have the owner's books and manuals in here. This car has two keys and these keys come with a third little button here, the AC button, so you can remote start the air conditioning from outside the vehicle. The inside of this car is clean. It does not have any odors in here. It's got multiple cup, cup holders, four cup holders in the front. Uh, two in the center, one in each door, and then two more in the rear uh, center console armrest. The steering wheel is tilt telescopic, and the seat is height adjustable. Unlike the older Priuses, the seats will adjust up and down. Of course, it will slide forward and back and recline, but it is height adjustable uh, seat, driver seat. On the rear, this is a hatchback. So the rear seat folds down. To fold the rear seat, you just pop up the headrest and tilt it forward. Push the little button and fold your seat down. If you fold both seats down or on the right side, and recline the front seat. Toyota says you can fit a kayak in here. I've seen pictures. You can do it. You can fit a kayak in one of these Prius. Uh, Prius plug-ins. Very nice car. The electric charging port is on the right side of the car and the gasoline fill is on the left side of the car. There's a little button on the dashboard to open that. Cargo area. This has a privacy shade in this car. And then this comes out. And then with one hand, I can fold the other seat down. So, so taking a look at the rear cargo area, this car has a brand new level two rated charger. So this charger may, depending on your electrical capability, be able to charge it faster than the normal three hours. Um, it has a rear cargo cover. The rear cargo cover I've removed. I folded the rear seat. And then you have a storage area here which you can stow the cargo cover or the charging cord or both. And then uh, it's a very nice car. Very clean. So to find out if a car can get the carpool stickers is kind of a complicated process. But this is how you do it. I'm going to take a car that can't get them, for example. This car had the green stickers. Any car that had green stickers or white stickers issued before 2017 cannot have use of the carpool lane without two people in the vehicle anymore. So I'm going to copy the VIN number right here. Highlight. Copy it. 
and I have the master list here of vehicles that are not eligible. This is a 2,000 page list. I'm going to paste the VIN number in there and I'm going to search for that car next. And while it's searching, I'm also going to show you there's two websites you need to know. California Air Resources Board website and they have the list of the types of vehicles that are eligible. Oh, it found it. Going back to the first list. That VIN number that I showed you for the green sticker car is on the list. So that cannot get carpool stickers because it's on this 2000 page spreadsheet. That's using file, edit, find, and then enter the VIN number and search for it. And if, if you find it on the list of vehicles that can't get it, then they can't get it. Uh, if And that applies to vehicles that are on this list. So I can look them up, any vehicle for you for fee. Uh, but this is how you do it. So for example, we're going to go down to model year on the California Air Resources Board list. We're going to go to 2012. There weren't very many options for plug-in hybrids. We go to Toyota, Prius plug-in hybrid. And then if the sticker under the hood is that, which they all are on Prius, um, then you can get the carpool stickers as long as not on this list. Uh, this is like the black list. This is the good list. You have to be both on the good list and not on the black list to get the stickers. That's how that works. As, as I mentioned, these tires are in really good shape. These are almost brand new. Let's look under the hood. nice and clean under here there's not much corrosion or anything like that this is a 2014 no uh, oils leaking very nice car 50 state emissions including California it's a very clean car down on the bumper you have these daytime running lights they're uh, for driving during the daytime the LED daytime running lights now I'm gonna wrap up my video as I go around here it circle the car some more. I mentioned this car is eligible for $10,500 in cash incentives to buy it. One of those is from our local power electric providers the Southern California Edison is offering a thousand dollar rebate. If you buy this car or a similar qualifying vehicle during 2019, uh, you can get a thousand dollar rebate from Southern California Edison. But then there's also a $9,500 cash incentive from the Replace Your Ride program. Now, if you go on the website, replaceyourride.com, you can see if you might be eligible. That's a little harder to qualify for because if you make too much money or you don't have an older trade-in, they're actually going to give you $9,500 for your old junkie trade-in, which may be worth $400. They'll give you $9,500 to trade that old beater in. Um towards buying one of these under the Replace Your Ride program. And those are great government benefits. I have some people who have come in buying some of the higher mileage cars, Prius plug-ins, and they're maybe paying $1,000 out of pocket to buy one of these cars with a higher mileage. This is a low mileage car, remember. This one only has 47,000 miles. And it costs new about 36,000, so it's a little bit more expensive, but still, these government incentives, if you could qualify, would pay more than half of the cost of buying the car. Anyways, you may just want it for the purple HOV stickers alone. The $1,000 Edison rebate may just be icing on the cake, even if you don't qualify for that $9,500 benefit. My name is Mike Johnson. Give me a call, 951-681-2101. This video was filmed as of March 2019. Thank you.